Okay, good evening everybody. It's Thursday, 4th of January, 2024. This is day four of my video journal. And maybe I could stare at the camera a little bit more. Um, not much to report today. I'm gonna split out all my diet stuff and gym and fitness stuff into um, another video series and into another channel. So if you want to go over and you want to see that, if you're interested at all in what I'm eating and how many calories I've had and how much fat intake I've had, then go for it. Um, that's all on the carnivore diet um, playlist. Otherwise, I'm going to try and keep this to just other stuff, basically. So what happened today? Um, annoyingly, again, I went in and recorded this whole thing once and then realized that the software tool I was using wasn't connected to the right audio. So I've had a problem again. So I'm, this is the second time I'm recording this. And I really want to use this software, but it's really making me angry because I keep having to re-record because of the weird way that it works. So, but I will persevere and see if I can make it work. So anyway, um, Today, what happened today? Um, had a really good meeting this morning with someone who is who's been a DJ and went to university to study um, music and audio in particular. So he's been a DJ, he's an audio engineer, sort of like Mike Russell that I've had on on my um, podcast before. But this guy's actually a DJ and and he uses a lot of the tools. So he had some really interesting thoughts on how AI is impacting that. And the reason I'm mentioning in this is because this week is episode 34, which is coming out tomorrow. But then I was stuck because I didn't have anybody um, to talk to because it's been really awkward because people have been away. They've been on holiday and all that. But he was free and able to do it. So now I have a podcast for next week, which is a massive stress. I was beginning to really stress over that. And um, that's been really good that I don't have to stress over that anymore. So I'm feeling quite relaxed. So whew, the week after I've got two and then everybody's back and it's fine and it's all rolling. And I've got like four other podcasts that are going to be running and I've got people to talk to and topics and everything for all of that. It was just a bit awkward here at the beginning of the year. So that's good. That'll make me feel a little bit more comfortable over the weekend. Um, and what else? Yeah, my, oh yeah. So my son, so this evening, um, for everybody in the UK who knows what GCSEs and A-levels and all that stuff are, my son had his GCSE um, ceremony this evening. So he went and picked up everything and that was lovely to go to the school and see some of our friends and, you know, to celebrate with him over his accomplishments. So that was really nice and fun to do, good little family activity. And we found out that one of our friend's daughters actually was the, um, she's, she scored the highest score across all the GCSEs of anyone in the school. And she didn't even know until tonight. So that was a total surprise for everyone and really, really nice. She's a lovely young girl and she's been in school with my son ever since they were five years old. And so they've, they've known each other for quite a long time. So it was really nice to, to have a friend of ours, um, you know, daughter, win that so that was really cool and that that actually made the the evening a little bit nicer um for people who are not in the uk um, mainly in the us i'm looking at you mom and dad um i know i've tried to explain this before but essentially the way it works in the us is you have starting in year nine so nine ten eleven and twelve that's high school and but in, and then when you graduate high school, the, what you do is you take all your exams, your final year of high school. If you pass all your exams and you've had the correct grades all the way through those four years, then what you get is a single diploma that says you have a high school diploma. And then you use that diploma and you take that off. You don't ever have to tell anybody what grades you made in each individual subject. The way it works in the UK is nine to 11. Well, you years seven to 11, um, it's called secondary school. And you basically go all the way through that. You study the various subjects, but in year 11, you take these tests called GCSEs. And I don't know what it stands for. Don't at me. And anyway, you take them in each individual subject. And instead of getting like a, a diploma, 
you actually get individual certificates for each subject. And then one, but once you've got all those and you've passed those, then you have a couple of different ways you can go, which again, I don't need to get into now, but you can kind of stay in school or you can go to junior college basically. Um, and so that's kind of what, that's where he is now. So he's just picking up the certificate from last year. Anyway, that's what was going on. We'll probably talk about school and A-levels, which is the next set of exams that he'll need to do next year um, and all that sort of stuff again, I'm sure. So, But anyway, really nice evening, nice to see some friends, get out, do a little bit of stuff. Um, my wife is, is um, wasn't feeling great over the holidays, but she's feeling better now, so that's fantastic. So yeah, everything's getting back to normal, new year, all good. I can't think of anything else for today. Not much to report, really. Now that I've split out the two things, otherwise I'd be talking about diet and gym and all that stuff, but I think it's better in that in, in that other playlist than it is here. So life-wise, everything's pretty good. Loads of new opportunities um, potentially at work, so I don't want to really talk about any of those specifically at the minute, but there's lots of potential um, and some exciting opportunities that people are bringing me into. So we'll see. It's uh, it's any salesperson or anybody who's ever worked in commercial, you know, you have to have a hundred opportunities, you know, and you might get 10% of those. And so the more, the more things you say yes to and try and plan and sort of see what's going to happen, the better. The hard part's coming down to actually signing a contract and getting someone to pay for something. So We'll see what happens over time, but um, but yeah, we're making progress, so feels good. I'm in a good mood. It's uh, 11 o'clock at night, so I'm going to wind up, edit the videos quickly, upload them, and then I'm off to bed, so I will see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.